How we transformed an entryway. So Marianne moved into this apartment a few months ago and we've been wanting since to uh, do this project. We finally got the time uh, to do it and to gather all the objects that we needed. Yeah. So we're so excited for this. So the plan is to first transform the wardrobe, uh, then we installed some shelves and uh, added some coat hangers and at the end added some decoration pieces. So yeah, let's get started. Had this wardrobe for quite some time, we started by cleaning all apparent stains with acetone using a dry piece of cloth. So we forgot to remove the handles. And since we are changing them, it's a good idea to remove them before starting the painting. The first step for painting a piece of furniture is to always apply a layer of primer to make sure that the color holds well. Also, whenever you start using any paint in a can, start by mixing it with a spatula, bringing the bottom part to the top to make sure that it is homogeneous. When you're done, pour some paint into a roller pan, we use 10 cm paint rollers that can be used for any surface type and we then let it dry for 6 hours. In the meantime, we sprayed the screws of one of the shelves and the coat hanger with the coat spray to match their color since they're apparent. We positioned the shelf on the wall between the entryway and the kitchen and by using the iPhone's measure app made sure that it was correctly leveled. We marked the wall with a pencil to know where to place the screws. Then we positioned the coat hanger under the shelf and did the same for the positioning and screw marks. the drill to make the holes in the wall, you can use duct tape to mark the depth needed for your screws. When holes are made, you can insert the plastic part that comes with the screws in them and then place the object that you want to hang and insert the screws. We then move to a second shelf that we are placing in the entryway. We also brought two small coat hangers that we placed on the wall behind the door. Thank you. 
Now back to the wardrobe. We used a sage green color and applied three layers of painting waiting around two to three hours between each application. To be honest, the painting instructions required a six hour waiting period between each coat, but we were kind of in a hurry to finish, so. The inside of the wardrobe was a bit old, so to cover it, we used gift wrap with leaf patterns and fixed it using duct tape. To make it easier, we removed all the shelves and placed them back once we were done. We then hung a mirror that we had previously DIY'd above the shelf. To cover part of the electrical paneling, we place a frame with the same gift wrap used for the inside of the wardrobe. Finally, we added some small decor pieces such as framed prints, plants and dried flowers. We also added a carpet and a footstool. This is it! You can see the before and after transformation.
try to do some more similar projects in the future to show you how you can transform small faces. But in the meantime, stay posted because we have a very cool uh, Lebanese dish recipe coming up next Wednesday. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe and see you next time.